Welcome to Quick Reviews, where we review games in 5 minutes or less. Today, we will be reviewing Baldur's Gate 3. We start with possibly one of the most important things that you will ever do in this game. Create a representable, serious character. Now, Baldur's Gate 3 gives you, well, um, it gives you options. Sometimes I do this just for fun, but I created Fuckles, the handsy man. And I really didn't spend long on this, but some people spent like four hours making a character, so I'd say that's pretty cool. Touching on gameplay, it works pretty much exactly like a D&D campaign would run, except there's a couple of minor different details, like for a lot of the time it rolls for itself, but there are occasions where you can roll for certain checks. It also works a lot like D&D where Every single character that you interact with will have some kind of effect on the story or a certain storyline. Like, every character has their own quests, what they like, what they don't like. If you interact with certain people in the wrong way, some companions might like it, some people might disagree with you, and it might get to a point where they end up leaving your party. Another thing I like about Baldur's Gate that they do quite well is every single decision that you make you can probably be a dick about <laughs> like for the most part you could probably betray everyone there is a good ending there is a bad ending and there's ways to make certain companions have good endings some have bad endings so if you don't like certain characters you could pretty much sabotage them and screw them over speaking of screwing companions Baldur's Gate lets you yeah, romance companions from this to this to this to uh to this dude i mean he's, he seems pretty normal and he is and and what did uh oh uh this is an option what's sick f <laughs> my final takeaway for the game would probably be you can literally fight however you want you can sneak bulldoze you could prep and plan you could even place explosives around someone while you're invisible and just set it off my favorite part about the combat at the moment has probably been pushing people off ledges that are supposed to be really hard battles and just seeing how easy the game becomes when you just think outside the box overall if you enjoy sucking fucking and fighting your way through a campaign Baldur's gate might just be for you and remember it's not about the destination it's about the birds we fuck along the way. I like you, and I want you. Now we can do this the easy way, or we can do it the hard way. The choice is yours.